like playing these games before the stream and like actually like learning how to play them because I have no fucking idea um how to play uh steelworker <laughs> this is this is something oh boy all right Let's let's look at the other. Uh, uh, Steelworker. It's a game of strategy, so you know I'm fucked. In this new title game, the player becomes a chief engineer at a construction site. The player must build a bridge of steel girders so that the steelworker may walk safely across the site. In order to do this, the player must select the right size girder out of many different sizes in the right directions and location for the girder. Delay or hesitation is very dangerous. If you're not quick enough in your selection. The steelworker falls and you lose. He's fucking dead. Uh, joining steel frames, let workers move from left to right. Use control levers, select proper steel frames out of samples. Push select button to join steel frames. Pushing reverse button will turn worker. Worker can turn nine times. Joining steel frame scores 50 points. Worker can join up to 15 frames to get a goal. Four workers per game. Game ends when the fourth worker falls. I like that they say when he falls, not when he fucking dies. So it's kind of like Lemmings? Kind of? Steelworker's walking speed accelerates at random. Oh, God. If you think he's on a collision course with elevators, use the reverse button to give you more time. Oh, boy. Okay. Yeah, it's kind of like, yeah, it's probably closer to Risky Challenge than, uh, than Lemmings, but play Steel Worker. Oh, man, look at him go. All right, show me how to do this demo. I don't know what the demo's doing. <laughs> I fell down. All right. So two buttons, right? Play player one. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. Let me lower the audio a little bit. Okay. Oh, you can't move until he actually, like... Okay. He's doing the bongo dance. Same player again. Oh god. Uh, oh! Space invaders noises. The stage changed! Okay, so if he runs into the elevator, I think he dies. After you make the selection, you can't, like, change it until he gets to the next thing. Alright. Wait, I thought I had four workers, not, uh... Three. Oh, shit. Oh, that doesn't count? Okay. Oh, it's different again! Okay, let's go that way. The levels aren't even, like, consistent. Okay, so I have to go across this. Why do you speed up? Okay. Might be good enough. Uh, I think you can use e each piece infinitely. As far as I can tell. Why did you speed up? Slow down, dude. His acceleration changes at random. 
I like how excited he is. Or maybe you get more bonus for using more pieces. I don't know. Uh-oh. Reverse, reverse, reverse! I don't know how to turn him around. Ow, my knee. Alright, let's try again. Oh, wait, let me look at the dip switches. <laughs> Imagine this being set to one life. What is the demo doing? Okay. It's weird how the, the stages, like, randomize. This is a roguelike. Okay, so I'm not sure how to use the reverse button. I guess you just hold it down. Also, who's who's building this for him? Am I God? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, no! He sped up. Oh, I gotta do this? That didn't... That didn't count on my reverse thing, though. Uh-oh. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. Yo, 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 we got this. Yeah. Yeah, the random speed ups, it is a roguelike. A rouge like. Oh, God. Reverse. Okay. It actually worked that time. Oh, he's going back up. Slow down, dude. Slow down. Slow down. Oh. Uh-oh. Why is he so hurried to go up the stairs? Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to reverse. What? No! No, dude! Dude! Alright. Okay, reverse. I can't change... Oh, jeez. No! No, wrong way! I can't find the right direction in time. It takes forever to get over there. Okay. This is stressful. Because you only have so much time to like switch uh, which piece you want to do. Because you can't you can't do it ahead of time. Don't. Okay, I didn't want to do that. Jesus Christ! You got to be so fast. Fucking random ass speed ups. Go back. Can I just do this forever? <laughs> uh -oh. He's committed to it. Bonk. It's like once he gets to the... Okay, yeah, once he gets to the section in the middle, he has to keep going. Like, you don't have an option to, to change there. Because if there's, if there's the part in the middle that's already made, he just has to keep going. 
Because I was trying to, I was trying to make something else. Oops, I hit the wrong button. Okay. Uh oh, I'm gonna get hit. That didn't count. All right, I don't, I don't understand what causes you to get hit by the, the elevators. Maybe you're safe when you're in that section? Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. He's gonna hit the gritty. Am I gonna get hit here? Yes. It's just really messed up that they randomized this. Okay. Alright, am I gonna get hit here? It's not gonna reach. Okay. Alright. Play same player again. Uh oh. I fucked up. I fucked I could I didn't have enough time to like select anything else. The, the speed ups are what kill you, because you don't have much time to like, select something else. That's why I feel like I just did this pattern, didn't I? This is like the exact same pattern. Alright, well, I don't really understand, uh... <laughs> What's up with those elevators in the middle? They call them elevators. I don't know if that's the proper term, but... Also, they will not let you, uh... When you get to the middle section, yeah, you have to... You have to connect it to that. You can't, uh, you can't do cheat season and go... Go across above or below it. Damn, they thought of everything. Well. It's, uh, it's something. <laughs> there was, there was definitely nothing like this in the arcades in 1980. It's got a, it's got a little bit of a learning curve to it. How far, uh, what's the high score for this on MARP? Hundred thousand! Vertex Dan, the, the god. Well. Yeah, it's it's all right. Yeah, I assume he could just play forever, so he just killed it off at. Uh, I would, I I guess the score rolls at a hundred thousand. I should watch that. Uh, I should watch that replay. All right. There's a replay on the MAME Action Replay page, yeah. I don't think there's a... I don't think it's on YouTube. 
But alright, pulls up. Um, I can probably guess how this one's going. It is... Uh, I don't know, is it too high concept? It's pretty high concept. <laughs> I'm not sure I'm the biggest fan of it, but I can I can certainly respect what it's going for. How's one get a hundred thousand in this? It does feel like there's a like a finite amount of patterns. So you just um, you just learn the best uh, the pieces to put down for each pattern. Although the random speed ups could fuck things up too. So I don't know. Vertex Dan's a beast. He's he's got a lot of beastly scores. So I'll have to look at that sometime. Anyway, Chad has decided this is a solid three bongos. I'll give it three bongos too. It's uh like I said, it's. It's it's like nothing else in the arcades in 1980. It's a completely different concept of game, and I can I can respect what it's going for. It's kind of frustrating to play, but but for 1980, it's definitely something something different. So good job, Taito. That makes up for uh, <laughs> that makes up for some of the other things, <laughs> kinda. <laughs> 